uh, bottom line is I was asked many times what kind of Republican I, I would be, and, and, and I, I really didn't know how to ask, answer that, so I just said I'm going to be a Scott Brown Republican. Maybe there's a new breed of Republican coming to Washington. Maybe people will finally look at somebody who, who's not beholden to the, the special interests of the party and who will look to, you know, just to solve, solve problems. You know, I, I've always been that way. I, I've always, I mean, you remember, I, clean, I supported clean elections. I've, I'm a self-imposed term limits person. I believe very, very strongly that we are there to serve the people, and we are there to do a job. And I, like many others throughout the, the country, you know, when we're talking about, well, what so-and-so said in his book and, and what so-and-so said here, my response is, who cares? Because we have terrorists that are trying to blow up our planes and, and, and kill our, our, our families at shopping malls. We have people dying in Afghanistan who are trying to, and, and, and our soldiers are trying to make sure that you know, we, we get, you know, finish the job there. And we have very serious economic problems. So I, 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 like probably many of you, say, what's up with that? We need to make sure that we, we solve the problems. And if I can bring that type of message to Washington and, and create the dialogue that gets us back to the basics, I'm all for it. As you know, I've always opened my door for everybody in the, in the State House, regardless of whether I agree on, with their position or not. And the one thing, I have to be honest with you, running throughout the campaign, even people who said they weren't voting for me, the one thing they said is, thank you for running a great campaign, thank you for making it about the issues, thank you for not keep, making it negative and bringing it in the gutter, and thank you for always being accessible. I may not have agreed with you, but the information that you gave me was accurate and timely so I could make a better decision. I am from a Big Ten philosophy, regardless of you know, the flyers and the, the commercials and all that stuff, I haven't changed a bit. I'm the same person today. I, I woke up, I walked the dogs, I gave my daughter, you know, who, who was really very emotional about going back to college, a hug and a kiss, and uh, you know, I'm going to miss her very, very much. So, of course I'm going to allow people to come in and talk to me. You, that's, that's, I'm so excited to have that opportunity because I learn more and more and more about the wonderful part type of this country. I'm sorry, the wonderful parts of this state. And I'm going to take one more question, Allison.